I'm here today because I want to talk about these scooters. Yeah, these scooters, these people be on. I hate them. I hate these scooters because they're so dangerous. So I was out driving the party bus Saturday and I was at the riverfront and then this girl was on her scooter. You know, she was riding with her boyfriend and he caught off the curb or whatever. She got off the curb and she was riding and then all of a sudden she just fell. And I'm like, damn, did she just fall out? Blah, just fell. And I was like, damn. I, and she was embarrassed more than anything. I'm sure she was hurt because her face hit the ground. And she got up, she was laughing, but it was an embarrassing laugh. And I was like, damn, girl, that's messed up. So I kept going with, with, you know, with my party, my group. And so it was another incident where I was doing a bus route and this lady, she had fell and hit her face. I didn't see when it happened, but as I came by, the ambulance was there. So, you know, I had to slow down. I went by and then I saw her face. Oh my God, her face was red. I mean, she was toe up. I'm sure she broke her damn jaw. That's how bad she hit that damn ground. And I was like, fuck, that's crazy. Then there was another incident. I was driving another party bus. And this girl was just riding the scooter. She was just going on down Broadway, just rolling. And then all of a sudden, she just slammed to the ground. And I was like, God damn, girl, what the fuck just happened? And I was like, oh, man. Mm, mm, mm. It took her a minute to get up, but she got up. And I, I look at those, um, I look at the, um, the wheels on that scooter. And I was like, these, 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 these wheels are too small. They're too, too small. And I remember back in the day, one of my neighbors, she had a scooter. It wasn't electronic. Those was the one that you had to push with your foot. And she had some bigger tires on that thing. And you could also air it up. You could, you know, you could air the tires up. And I, you know, and I felt more safe riding that scooter back in the day than I, you know, would now. And I see a lot of these older people on these scooters, you know, and I, and I know it's easy access to get around. You don't have to walk everywhere and stuff like that. But some of these people ride these scooters carelessly. Most of them are drunk. And there have been some um, instances where people have died. They um, got hit by a car. Uh, one lady, she was come, She came to town to visit. She was drunk, and the back wheel of the AT wheeler ran her over. And I said, what a fucking way to die, you know? So about two weeks ago, there was an accident to where this guy, he was, I, I, I think the guy, the man was drunk. He was an older man. And they said he came out real fast hit this guy who was from Memphis on a scooter, broke the scooter in half. So I was on the party bus. I had to drive around. You know, I'm looking that he's on the ground. They got the man out the truck. He was on the ground. They was, you know, working with him because he broke a damn uh, pole in half. And the guy was in critical condition. I thought the dude was dead because they was really working on that guy that was on that scooter. And um, I was like, fuck, this is bad business right here. And um, I was like, what a way to go. You out of town and you go somewhere and get fucked up like that. So those scooters are not safe. I never ridden them. I looked at one and I was like, man, I just don't even feel safe touching this damn scooter. And I don't. It, it, they were supposed to get rid of those scooters, but I think somebody paid somebody under the table to keep those scooters in town because they did mention that they was going to get rid of those scooters because they were unsafe. And people get drunk and they ride 
and most of them ride in front of cars and shit and get knocked off. When they first brought those scooters in town, these young kids was hacking them and then they would ride all out in front of people, rush hour traffic and stuff. It's been plenty of times I almost took some kids out. And I was like, they need to do something about this shit because it is very, very dangerous. It's very dangerous. So if they had a petition to get rid of those damn scooters, I think, no, I know I would sign it because it is dangerous. It is very, very dangerous. They say on there, you're supposed to wear a helmet. You're supposed to ride in the street and they do ride in the street, most of them, but they don't wear helmets. And it's like, oh, wow, it's crazy. It is very, very crazy. So if you're gonna ride them scooters, please be safe. Please don't ride in front of cars. Don't ride in between cars. <sighs> Just be safe. But if it was left up to me, I'd get rid of the motherfuckers because they're not safe. They're not safe for anybody. All right, peace.